Welcome to a new series from Dawn of Geospatial World. In this series, we will learn to do different hydrological analysis with the help of ArcMap and QGIS. Like, share and comment on this video. Press the subscribe button and turn on bell notification to get instant updates from our channel. Grab a cup of coffee and let's dive into hydrological analysis. In the first video, I am guiding you how to extract a watershed or river catchment area. For this, we need a digital elevation model data. You can use SRTM, ALOS, ASTAR or Cartosat DEM. All DEM download process videos are uploaded on our channel. You can check them if required. After adding DEM data in ArcMap, go to Toolbox and select Spatial Analyst Tool. Go to Hydrology and open Fill Tool. You can also search these tools in Search. Select DEM data as input and set Parallel Processing as 0. Save the output and run. After filling the voids of DEM, let's create flow direction from DEM. Go to Hydrology and select flow direction. Select fill DEM as input and run the flow direction tool. After some processing, a flow direction raster will generate it according to the DEM. Now go to Hydrology and select Flow Accumulation. Select DEM as input and run the tool. After some processing, Flow Accumulation raster will generate it. Go to Properties of this raster and change its symbology as Classifier. Set two classes and class values as 10,000. If you want more flow channels, then set the value as 15,000 or higher. You can change the colors for better understanding. You can extract river catchment area or basin or watershed in two ways. I am showing them one by one. Go to hydrology and select basin. Input flow direction and create a raster image for basin. Here you can see all river basins are generated. Some are large river basins and some are small basins. To select any basin, go to conversion and convert this raster to polygon. After converting, select the required river basin and export this as a shapefile. On the other hand, you can extract a river basin by an outlet point. Those rivers which are connected and go through that point will separate it. To do this, first create a point shape file. Now enable editing of that shape file and mark one point on channel raster. Mark this point very carefully.
Now go to hydrology and select watershed. Input flow direction and outlet point and run the process. After processing, the watershed area for that point will generate it in raster form. Convert this raster into shapefile as polygon. So in this first video, you have learned how to extract watershed or river catchment area in ArcMap with the help of DEN. In the next video, we will learn how to extract channel or river network and create river shape file for this catchment area. For that, you need to like and share this video and subscribe to this channel.